Aaron here with your featured paintings update for July. We've got some really great paintings that our artists have chosen that I think really capture summertime on canvas quite well. Uh, first, we have Palm Beach Hammock by Southern California artist Ashley Merchant. She's done a great job with this pink and purple sky that I think is really perfect for you know a hot Florida sunset. It's got this hammock here and I'm a big fan of hammocks so I just see myself lying in that hammock just enjoying the view but then I look up at these really tall shaggy trees and it kind of scares me because like what if a coconut falls and hits me on the head I'd be done though. So if you're like me and maybe afraid of coconuts you should probably paint like a little hard hat in there or something to protect your noodle. Or maybe it's sunrise, like just after the spring break partiers have gone to sleep. It's like, shh, don't wake the drunk college kids. This next one is called Pine Lake at Sunset by Shannon Chiba, an artist from Springfield, Massachusetts. Uh, I'm gonna get a little Bob Ross on this one because I love this painting. It just to me, this is, you know, at the end of the day after being on the lake, you've been boating, swimming, cliff jumping, whatever, and I just see myself sitting here enjoying the view with a beer and just thinking about how much I don't want summer to end. It's awesome. Painting is really great for adding other things to it as well. Like a lot of people will add some nice birds up in the sky or maybe extend the land out a little farther into the water or, you know, add in like the Loch Ness monster. And I'm like, hey, that's cool. I believe. And last we have Sunrise Seaside by Chicago artist Stephanie Mercier. Uh, looking at this painting, you can just feel the calm. Uh, you know, th there's no boat on the water, no one's at the beach yet, the sun is just rising. Uh, it's like when you witness a scene like this, you can't help but feel like you're being let in on one of nature's like little secrets. Uh, these colors are just incredible. And these long pieces of dune grass or cattails or whatever they are, they kind of look like they're just waking up. They're yawning, they're like, ah, good morning world. That wraps up our featured paintings for July. Be sure to check them out at paintnight.com and let us know what you think by commenting below. See you next month.